Messengers don't make jokes in regards to commandments. So when they said, are you taking us as a joke? What's the response of Musa alayhi salam? Qala a'udhu billah. First thing, I seek refuge in Allah. What does that tell us? That tells us that making jokes in regards to commandments of Allah is something very serious. And if you're engaged in it, you better seek the protection of Allah because that can only be from shaitan. And then he says, أَنْ أَكُونَ مِنَ الْجَاهِلِينَ I seek Allah's protection, His refuge, that I might become from those... Now the translation says ignorant. But jahil, part of the meaning of jahil is ignorant. But that's also ghafil. Heedless, ignorant. Jahil actually is the opposite in Arabic of aqil. It's the, it's the, you know, the lid of aqil. Aqil in Arabic means someone who has control over their emotions. Jahil means someone who has no control over what they say and what they do. They have no restraints on them. So Musa alayhi salam says, if you think I am joking with you about what Allah commanded, then I, that would be an act of jahil. That would be an act of lack of restraint. I seek Allah's protection from ever being that way. قَالَ أَعُوذُ بِاللَّهِ أَنْ أَكُونَ مِنَ الْجَاهِلِينَ Once again, in my final point about this, to just to relate something as a lesson to what we're facing right now. Among Muslims, especially among youth, certain things have become a joke. And they've become a joke with us, with American Muslim youth, because we see them as a joke in the larger society. For example, even in elementary school, and I'll just come out and say it, because you guys have to know this stuff, jokes about homosexuality are common. It's a joke. You're acting gay, don't be gay, this and that, you're such a homo, etc., etc. You know, that's what she said, these kinds of jokes that have to do with fornication, adultery, homosexuality. These are common jokes. It's considered small talk. It's not a big deal. Are these serious matters of crimes as far as our deen is concerned? They're very serious. The first, la- la- the first line of defense, the first crack, when you stop taking something seriously is when you can joke about it. If you can joke about it, it's an indication you no longer take it that seriously. So when the society jokes about it, you know, homosexuality was actually entered into mainstream culture in America, if you study its history, it was entered by means of comedy. It was entered by that means. Eventually, first it was something to be laughed at and laugh about and it was entertaining. And eventually just became so much so a part of, you know, uh, the, the culture that it's kind of crazy. You know, a, fr- a friend of mine was playing basketball the other time in New York City. In Queens, he's playing ball, and somebody called a foul, and the other guy says, man, you're being gay. And the guy goes, what's wrong with that? And he starts like getting angry. This is how crazy it's become, <laughs> you know? But our children, Muslim children, don't think they're immune from these things. They hear these things all the time. They see them all the time. So when that's, what this happens to them, they, they make jokes about these things that in and of themselves are completely and utterly unacceptable in Islam. And this would be an act of jahl. Because the first thing is to be able to joke about it, and once that, that line has been crossed, you don't know where it goes eventually. Because now that thought has become common. And these utterances have become common. The things you say a lot are the things you think about a lot. And when you think about something a lot, it influences you. You know it influences. This is why we have to have very strict sensitivity in regards to what we allow our, our, ourselves and our children to say. And especially youth, sometimes even religious youth make these kinds of jokes not realizing the potential harm they're doing to themselves and the environment around them. Because they say it's harmless, everybody's doing it, everybody has these kinds of jokes, it's not a big deal. Well it is, 